Like you 37, go. Sign Q60, go. Projection Q13, go. Stand by like you 40 through 43, go. <laughs> The Moor is like by far the most capable theater that I've ever worked in. It's like a professional theater, um, you know, working with just in with the resources of the department. You know, being able to use different professors. You know, being in the cast with Jamie has been amazing. It's definitely the smallest cast that I've ever been in, and it's been really nice having that because um, I've been in a lot of shows with just ginormous choruses and you know, extras and all these kinds of things, which is really fun too, because you get to know a lot more people, but this play is so beautiful and so surreal and so poetic, and I just think that, um, you know, working with a professor, working with, you know, six other, six other cast members? Seven in total. No, six. <laughs> Evan, stop. I actually didn't act at all in high school. I, um, I had to football, wrestling, and track, so I was always playing sports, but uh, I've always loved movies and acting and that kind of thing, and I always thought that I could be pretty good at it, so uh, when I got here, saw the opportunity, so I just jumped at it. The resources here are a lot greater than they were in high school. Um, and the technical elements are obviously a lot greater. In high school, it was just basically like lights up, lights down. Mm -hmm. But here, um, especially like Dan is my faculty advisor, so to be able to work with him and see like how much goes into the technical production is pretty incredible. I worked on the projections. The set worked as essentially a large projector screen, and there were two projectors, and I uh, assisted Dan in fine-tuning the projections so that they looked best for the show and were ready to go. One of the most interesting aspects of this show is being able to work with Jamie um, and having the students get to act on stage with a professional actor and a professor I think has taught them a lot um, and has created a really nice dynamic in the show. And uh, Jamie is just a really excellent actor and he's just such a wonderful lovely person anyway so it's just he makes it really easy and fun, and he's also like taken me aside a lot, and we've talked a lot about you know the process behind um, some of these like really emotional scenes and how you get to that place where you need to be when you're on stage and the lights, and so he's been you know a mentor, a friend, just it's been that's been one of the coolest parts about this process, and he's just such a wonderful person and a really talented actor. I don't know, it's kind of a culture shock. I've never worked technical theater before coming to Dartmouth, so it's, it's totally different. I've learned so much just about dealing with people and um, working with actors is a lot of fun. I did a lot of acting before I came to Dartmouth. Um, this is the first time I've really worked on the technical side of production, which was also really cool. Uh, especially here because all the tech is at a very, very professional level. I didn't know any like terms or um, like any acting or stage, anything. And um, they just been, they tell you what to do, but um, it's very kind of relaxed and accepting of newcomers and things like that. Being in this theater, first of all, being able to work with such talented people, um, you know, all the great designers that we've got and everything, it just, it makes it really feel like you're not just in this play for fun and you're, you know, you're joking around. It's like it's really a production and you get into it and you're doing it and you really just, you're that much more kind of devoted to it and you're that much more disciplined and you do that much more work for it and you just feel that much more attached to it.